It is July 17, 2023. I was messing around on YouTube. I live on social media. I'm always on Instagram, YouTube, Facebook, and sometimes I'm on Twitter. I got to give my Twitter account some love. But um, I'm making this video because I read something on YouTube. No, no, it was Instagram. It was on Instagram about Dubai. And um, I used to work at Plant Vogel. And when you're working at Plant Vogel, you're around a bunch of people, like, all over the world. Turn my air on. You're surrounded around all kind of people from all over the world. And I never forget, years ago, this guy, he liked black women, chocolate women like myself. He wanted to take me to Dubai. I reneged. I told him no. Because at that time I didn't know anything about Dubai. I just told him no because I really didn't know him like that. And then I'm not racist or anything like that. I'm not really into white guys. And if I go anywhere, I don't want to go overseas. And by the way, <laughs> I know I'm just an open book. I go on my first plane ride this Friday. Yay! Anyway, but this is not what this video is going to be about. So anyway, uh, this guy wanted to take me to Dubai. And I turned him down. Over the years, I learned that Dubai is very expensive. And it's where like a lot of, I guess, rich people are. And this man, he had money. The guy that asked me to go to Dubai. And plus, he was a traveler. Anybody know what Plant Vogel is? No, it's a lot of men that are make money. <laughs> they, they're not bullshitting when it comes to money. So anyway, I learned over the years from watching like YouTube, hearing people talk, that they're not nice to black women. So now as time go by, I'm glad that I dodged the bullet. Now I'm thinking that this guy that asked me did I want to go to Dubai, I'm glad that I renege. I'm not one of these hoochie mamas that, you know, anytime a guy asks a question, I'm jumping on it or I'm jumping on his dick, you know. I, I try to take my time. But I'm learning that Dubai, they very horrible to black women. They usually uh, use them as sex slaves. Um they shit on them literally put shit on them and a lot of the women they take up there they know that they don't have a lot of money and if you don't do what they say do you can be up there forever being someone's slave or whatever that's getting mistreated they, they don't like uh american black women they look down on us and they probably look down on us because if they over there and they looking at black folks as a whole and they looking at music videos and they always see women twerking, black women twerking, black women with their titties out, black women with their asses out, black women going to buy fake asses just to get cheated on again. So I can understand them looking at us like we beneath them like or we just some sex objects or whatever. And this video is going to be about one thing, but I done got carried away. But anyway, um, I can see why other cultures look at black women like we're disgraced or we beneath them because what we betray, hell, um, what's her name, uh, India Ari, she was just talking about, I think, a music video or award show she went to and all these professional women up there twerking like okay you have talent you have something other than your butt to twerk like you have professional dancers they can teach you how to do body movement where you don't have to twerk you can do like dances where you don't have to twerk and still look sexy Beyonce she she twerked one time out of the years and years she been famous I only seen her twerk one time but you can still be sexy and do like movement without twerking. Uh, Janet Jackson, 
she started it all hell she's a very fantastic dancer she don't have to twerk and so i can see these other countries looking at like american videos and that's all they see black women as like okay they sex symbols they sex objects all they want to do is suck and fuck you know i i can imagine that that's what they think um i'm learning from other stuff that i heard people say how they treat black women like oh my god so the most recent thing i heard about dubai is you cannot raise your voice as a woman to a man now of course if someone nasty to you in america you can raise your voice you can tell people how you feel but a black woman just did some time in jail for raising her voice like wow and all that, again, made me think back to this guy I used to work with. He asked me that I want to go to Dubai. Didn't know shit about Dubai at the time. Didn't even know it was on the map. I'm sorry. But I constantly keep thinking to myself, oh, my God, this man might have bad intentions, you know, for me. I just knew him from work. It wasn't like we was really dating or anything major going on between him and I we just really worked together I just really knew him through work and yes he had the money or whatever he probably was trying to see was I gonna go on a date with him like okay she gonna go on this expensive as a trip let me see and I got it for a whole month I could do whatever that man could have did whatever with me mistreated me made me a sex slave hell for all I know he might didn't like blacks and because somebody has sex with you, that don't mean they like you. Men have sex with women all day, every day that they really don't like. And they are short in their actions. Yeah, they'll bust that nut or whatever, but they are short like in other ways. Like, mm, you just disposable, bitch. Like, you know, they will show it. But that blew my mind. I was on Instagram and I saw this post of a woman going to jail simply because she raised her voice. And I found out that she wasn't even in the room. Let's see if this is my waiter app. I need some money. Come on, waiter. There you go. Kinda find out she wasn't even in the room. And she went to jail. Can you imagine going to jail for raising your voice and you haven't done anything wrong? Oh, shit. Oh, I'm trying to do this waiter thing. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and end this because I got to make my money. I got to make my money. And plus, I got my trip to go to. I got to make my money. Bye.